Hello everyone, very good morning and you are watching Bindu. Bindu is back to you and today we are preparing Kanvi. Kanvi is very popular, it's a like a snack, it's savory but very warm, savory and it contains very low oil and full of protein because it is made from chickpea flour and this is very popular recipe from India the state of Gujarat and Maharashtra. Normally we are preparing only plain with the turmeric khanvi but today I'm showing you two more recipe, two more color with the beetroot and coriander. So let's get started. First I'm showing you basic. I'm using half cup of chickpea flour, half a teaspoon of turmeric powder, salt per taste, And I'm using as a fortidia and this is helping you to digest kandui. Sometimes some people have got a problem to digest a chickpea flour. So this will help to digest your kandui. I'm adding here half a cup of yogurt and I'm using normal plain yogurt. Half a cup of yogurt. And now first make sure that you are breaking all the lumps from the flour. And we want a very smooth texture of it. In this, I'm adding one cup of plain water. I'm not adding all together. Gradually, I'm adding water in it. So you can see here our yellow color batter is ready. I'm keeping this aside. For red color, I'm using again half a cup of chickpea flour. less than half a teaspoon of asafoetida, half a teaspoon of salt and one cup of beetroot juice. This juice I have prepared with the beetroot. I have made one tablespoon of chunk of beetroot and then I have cooked it with a half cup of water and then I have blended this and make a puree and then I have strained it and prepare a juice a very plain juice and now I'm adding here juice before juice I'm adding here half a cup of yogurt and first mix this very well so now our yogurt is very well mixed with the um, chickpea flour and I'm adding here one cup of beetroot juice So here our red color puree is ready. Green color, I'm again using half a cup of chickpea flour. Salt per taste, like half a teaspoon. Pinch of asafoetida, hing. You can omit this if you don't like, but I'm using this so you can digest easily and half a cup of yogurt first mix them very well after mixing this yogurt and chickpea flour I have prepared here juice of coriander one tablespoon of chopped coriander and I have used one cup of plain water and made a puree and then strain it I'm using one cup of this first I'm adding very small proportion and mix it well so here are three flavor our mixture is ready, first with the plain turmeric, second with the coriander and third with beetroot. So let's get started with this first. I have switched on flame here and on low to medium flame, I'm pouring this without oil, simply I'm pouring this mixture in the pan. And we are cooking this till it gets nice and thickened. I'm stirring this, constantly stir this. So there's no lumps and it won't stick on the base of the pan. So you can see here it's getting so here our mixture is ready and I'm switching off the flame and first I'm pouring spatula here on a steel plate. You can pour on a silver foil as well. Make sure that you are making very nice and thin. After spreading to one side, I'm spreading it at the back as well. You can 
see same way I'm cooking here uh, coriander flavor puree and I will cook it till it gets nice and thickened and it start to re release this base after that I'm going to spread it on a steel dish or any like a plain metal dish you have you can spread on it and let it cool down and then we are cutting it and then rolling it after cooking this green mixture I have spread it on a steel plate and now I'm rolling this here our beetroot flavor gravy is ready and I'm going to spread it on a plate. So here our three colors khandwis are ready and now it's time to tadka. So let's prepare tadka. Oil is ready. I'm using one teaspoon of mustard seed, one teaspoon of sesame seeds and freshly chopped red chili. 1 to 2 teaspoons. So say switch off the flame and now tadka is going on the top of the tandoori. Here our tandoori is ready to serve. I have sprinkled fresh coconut, grated coconut on the top of it. Hope you all have enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Keep watching. See you all next time. Till then. Bye bye.